And as we approach the one year anniversary of the Marshall Fire, the rebuilding process remains slow and messy. The process for replacing the sentimental possessions lost can be equally complicated. Thankfully for some, employees at Mike's Camera know a thing or two about photo restoration. Our Colette Bordelon shares one family's story. Well, we're, you know, entryway, we're walking in and this, this is the first time. It feels so hopeful. Melissa Lockman is walking through what will be her new home. You know, at some point, I wasn't sure if I wanted to be back here. And this feels pretty magical. The kitchen, which her family the started and rebuilding a little over a month ago. Of course, like we lost everything, so we lost our piano. Is it all traumatic walking through this a year later? We are doing okay. Um, my daughter, every night, still, every night at bedtime, she asks me if there's going to be a fire. Resilience, one of the only things the Marshall Fire couldn't take from the family. Photographs are a big part of what feels really painful to lose. Even though she was convinced her pictures were gone, something spurred Lockman and her friend Genevieve Russell. You could never like love a coworker more than I love Genevieve. <laughs> to search through the rubble one more time. And when we found photos, it was just like mind blowing. I knew they were invaluable. Russell took the boxes filled with thousands of pictures. Thanks for calling Mike's Camera Boulder. This is Kurt. To someone who could help. This box happened to be next to their hot water heater while everything in the basement was burning and the hot water heater ruptured. Curtis Busack says that water likely saved the decades of memories. It's almost like these were meant to be saved. I believe that. I really do. Mike's camera restored as many pictures as they could. And the three of us worked on it from open to close for three straight days. Charging them only around a third of what it would normally cost. It felt like this gift it, that just needed to be taken to the right place. This is me. That's you. Isn't that crazy? Oh we get old. As the family <laughs> rebuilds and focuses on the future, the pictures of their past still tell the stories they can relive again and again thanks to the people who cared. It's really a story about people who just show up in hard times. Colette Bordelon, Denver 7. What a great story.